Welcome to uh, our subject engineering drawing. Today we are going to draw the freehand sketching. Three views for this given object. This is the object. For this object, I consider this is the front view portion. Then what are the things visible? In front view, I will draw in front view. Then this is your side view, then top view. Now I will I will explain one by one for the front view. Here the bottom portion it will be seen as this uh, yellow color it will be seen as rectangle with two vertical lines right. Then coming into the second part the top portion we need to have this uh, tapered surface in this particular area. So we need to draw this pink color thing. Then one whole part is removed so we need to draw this hole. This gives the idea about the front view of this particular object right then coming into the, the top view now for our understanding i will tilt it like this or otherwise you can see here the first this outer area it will be seen as h right in top view it will be seen as h like structure first we need to draw as the base then for the top um, rose color or pink color portion we need to draw like this this will be seen as rectangle right this tapper surface also seen as the slant surface also seen as the this particular rectangle right here this uh, hole is not visible that's why we drawn the center line and the two daughter lines representing the invisible hole in top view. it gives the idea about the top view coming into the side view that means your right side view should be drawn on the left side for the object in first angle projection here the yellow color line yellow color rectangle first we need to draw then for the front view this slanting surface will be seen as the vertical rectangular surface one here also this hole is not visible while viewing in side view that's why we need to draw this in tartar line so this is the idea about the tartar line for this particular object now quick review for this particular object we turn the three views in freehand sketching by using the first angle projections method okay thanks for watching this video